morning everybody. We are in Baxter, Tennessee. Today, we will be telling the greatest trucking story ever. trailer here making sure we're good we're about to get out of here about 360 miles to Illinois get this thing delivered man good night of sleeping we uh yeah ain't really much going on we just gotta get this thing delivered go into a uh harbor freight you know how that's gonna be I've had other videos in the past about it, and I, I would assume that this one won't let me down either. <laughs> but, uh, God. Difficulty. I give it a, probably, I haven't even looked. It's going to be something good, so. At least 8 out of 10. That's just a norm. Why is this open? It's weird. It's like the door weird but uh let me get this pre-trip going we gotta get rolling we gotta get around nashville we're about we're about 60 miles east of nashville right now so this ought to be fun so saturday morning won't be too bad all right let's get rolling
Not really. She's just going to get us a snack. <laughs> I'm just cleaning the windows. Now I will. All right, we're here. Drop off. We gotta do the old double drop and hook deal. So this could be a little bit. Gotta love it, man. Gotta love it. It's freaking hot out here, man. It's like it's summertime or something. All right, let me get this done. We'll let you guys know what's happening after this. trailer. I think we're good. Oh, I hate these things. Uh, I can't even reach it. Who would put that up there? Got a little bit of trash in here. No big deal. We're on the way to... Where are we going? Nellie's Lodge, Missouri. More trash. Oh no. Ah, it's shutting me in. Uh oh. Oh no, here we go, people. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, so there's like it's like another trailer over here. There's never there's never two trailers over here. stuff in there. Huh. Uh. Guess I gotta let dispatch know about that. I didn't have no locks on this thing, man. I said it was their return freight going back. here oh damn what's going on back here uh, I thought it was a flat spot I was just like oh crap all right let's head on Nellie's Lodge Missouri <laughs> slide these tandems fight and fight and fight and fight so first I had to use the old PB and uh, just kind of spray up on there banged it a couple times and it won't come all the way out so I gotta use the old vice grip deal so I think I may have got it this time Come on. 
the crap's on their tight. <laughs> Much like work today. Double drop and hook. Now this. Uh, I just want to take a shower. Let's see what's going on here. Talk to you a little bit. So we made it to Matthews, Missouri. The loves 55 South. Exit something. I don't even know what an exit it is. It's right across the street from the uh, the pilot over there at the Denny's that burned to the ground. The place is getting uh, crazy. I'm just sending in my trailer report for the day, if I re remember, because I didn't do it last night. Then they send me a nasty note. All right, I think that's it. All right, good, we're done there. Yeah, another good day, 5.63 today. We're about to get, to actually, shower, then eat. And tomorrow, deliver in Memphis. To, I don't even know where at, Fred's. We're going to a Fred's, whatever that is. So, yeah, so we're gonna tell the greatest story ever. Did you want? Did you want? You want me to tell a story? Huh? Huh? Go ahead. You're dying to tell it. Okay. I, you gotta. It. You gotta tell this story. And, and I'm. And it. I'm only telling this story because. Because I was involved. You know, if it was just one other person involved, which I, I can't name any names. <laughs> I swear it wasn't her, but she's not laughing at that. But uh, if it wasn't just another person that I wouldn't tell the story but since it was me yeah I was kind of half involved and it was actually half my fault too but so we're we were at the loves and uh, uh where were we it was in Kentucky I, I want to say Kentucky anyway so we stopped got fuel get something to drink and we both had to use the restroom like something terrible so uh we we're like Beeline. <laughs> I'm already laughing. I'm straight to the restroom. She she hits the left. I go straight into the bathroom. And uh, look at that truck, man. That's pretty. Oh, I like that. Nice. That's pretty. Big old sleeper. Big old sleeper. Um, let me see here. I think he's gonna turn around. Let's see if I can turn the camera on real quick. Is he gonna turn around? I don't think he's gonna turn around. Oh well, I'm ready for him. So, uh, <laughs> so first I go. I think he's coming around. Hold on, we gotta. You gotta see this truck first. Unless he's going into that shop or something. I'm not sure. Ah, oh, come on. Okay. Oh, here he comes. Camera. Here he comes. Ah, oh, he's having a hard time turning that thing. It's a big old sleeper. Oh, I'm gonna feel dumb now if he's actually going on a. It's an old Mac with like a big old extended sleeper. This is a nice truck and truck. It's an old truck. It's nice. Says. Nice. Actually, nice clean trailer too. Matching. It's very really nice. All right. So, uh, so I, I I head into the bathroom, and the first thing I thought, I walked into the bathroom, and I was like, man, this is the cleanest restroom I've ever seen. And it was like, it was like, why is the lights all like dim? It was almost like. Like they're getting ready for like a, 
like a like candlelit dinner. It was like mood lighting and stuff. And I it was like boom. I was like, oh damn, <laughs> I'm in the wrong freaking bathroom. And I'm like, oh man, she walked into the wrong bathroom. <laughs> it's like so I like just just cut it, turned around, ran out, ran into the men's bathroom. And as soon as I I go into the men's bathroom. I see her hand, like she's shutting the door. She's got like her black fingernails. And I see her shut the door. And I was like, there's like two dudes in the stall, some dude on the urinal. And I was like, babe, come on. And like, she was freaking out because there's some crazy man like trying to open the door. So she wouldn't say anything. So I'm just standing there like, my wife is in the bathroom, in the men's bathroom. And I was like, oh my gosh. So, so we sat there for a minute and, you know, a couple guys go to leave and they're probably wondering like, what's this strange lunatic man standing here in the middle of the bathroom, not doing nothing. So finally she goes to walk out and I like slammed the door and I was like, no, nah, nah, you can't come outside. So I'm like, you know, at, at a love's bathroom, when is it ever besides two o'clock in the morning, nobody in the bathroom. So I just, we had to stand there and wait. And finally it was like, there was no we were gonna stay in there for hours so finally it's like this was the only opportunity some guy washed his hands and he left probably because he was freaking out because i was standing there and another guy was at the urinal and i'm like we're going so i opened the door ran out and there was no one there except right when we got to the door who was there a little old black man he was walking in as we we're walking out <laughs> oh man i can only think what he was thinking like what in the world oh my gosh man <sighs> greatest it, it's probably not the it's probably not the greatest trucking story but it, it's a that's a pretty freaking good one man yeah i've heard some good ones and that probably this story will probably well she probably won't never well it won't get told again. <laughs> Sworn to secrecy to never tell this story again. Huh? No, oh, it's on YouTube. Well, at least everyone can share it out, you know? <laughs> share this video. No, I'm kidding. This, uh, I walked into the woman's restroom and thank goodness nobody's seen me. Well, I don't know if anyone's seen me, but <laughs> I don't know if there's anybody in there. But damn, you women. You got a nice freaking bathroom in there, man. <laughs> it's pretty. Lights are dim. If it was guys walking in there, we'd be freaking falling asleep at the, sitting on the toilet. Man. And, and as we're walking out, I told the lady at the register, some crazy man walked in the women's restroom. <laughs> oh, man. What a day. That was, that was yesterday. It wasn't today. But, man, today was a hard day. Good day. Glad it's over. You ready to take a shower? No. Oh. That means she's ready for a shower. I'm not ready for a shower. All right, let me finish my stuff. We're I done. Did what? Two jobs already. Two jobs. What else is there to do? I didn't take this trash. Oh, trash. Trash detail. All right, we got to go. Uh, <laughs> appreciate you guys watching. Long day today. We will check in tomorrow as we go deliver to Memphis. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.